Socializing 74. I had a thought which I wanted to share. It is important for Muslims to understand an important point in respect to advising others. It is the duty of Muslims to advise others towards good and forbid evil. But a Muslim should not behave as if they have been put in charge as controllers over others. This attitude only leads to anger and bitterness especially when others do not follow their advice. It is best for Muslims to discharge their duty by advising others, but they should avoid stressing over the outcome of their advice meaning whether the person ACTS on their advice or not. If Allah, the Exalted, advised the greatest teacher and guide of mankind namely, the Holy Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him. Not to stress over the outcome in many places of the Holy Quran, how can a Muslim claim or behave as if they have been put in charge of others? Chapter 88 al Ghashiyah Verses 21 to 22. So remind, you are only a reminder. You are not over them a controller. The Muslim who behaves as a controller will not only become bitter when people fail to follow their advice, but it can lead them to giving up advising others, which is a duty on all Muslims according to their ability. In addition, this attitude will also cause Muslims to neglect themselves and their own duties, as they are too busy concerning themselves with the duties of others. Therefore, Muslims should remain firm in commanding good and forbidding evil, but refrain from observing and bothering about the outcome of their advice. Over 400 free ebooks, audiobooks, infographics, podcasts, and blogs available on our website www.shakepod.com.